I've been here for hours now. Hours? I feel like I've been here for years. What do you expect, Misty? For you to hush, Eddie. You've been complaining this whole time. Well, for your information, Don, I wanted to work with another seaboard unit, and now you thrice at junks. The only reason I respect you is because you're an EMD and not a crappy GE. Huh? What's this? It's a filthy mutt, you fat white to wide cap junk. Are you blind? Oh, be quiet. You first, you abominable Jivo junk. Oh, hi there, little one. <laughs> she seems to like me. Would you like to come with us for a ride? Yeah, she's a cute dog, isn't she? She's just so cute. Cute? Cute? Who cares about that stupid ugly dog? All that matters is Seaboard. Plus having that nasty little furball is gonna be a big mistake. Have you forgotten the rules, mistakey? In the words of Kesha, all I'm hearing is blah, blah, blah. Ah, just shut up about that annoying song already. Gosh, I hate these stupid mainstream music today. They're just as garbage as you white cap junks. Okay then, Boomer. Boomer? Who are you calling a boomer? And who said that? Well, you do realize that not all modern music is bad, right? The sound got all quite catchy. Be quiet. All I want to listen to is a silver line boogie and not be reminded of that crap we have today. Huh. There seems to be a tag on it. Wow! Congratulations, Sherlock! You just solved another one! It says... Miso. Miso? That's a cute name. I heard it means smile in Korean. Well, I only Miso and ex word unit, so who cares? Finally, there's our crew. But what am I gonna do about this poor little dog? My crew might reject him. Just leave that little mop in here! We're not allowed to have a dog with us anyways! I'm not leaving this poor dog here. She could get hurt, or worse. Like I even care? Leave her here! Oh, I have an idea. Since Eddie is the one dead in tow, she can hide in his cab. Me? Why me? I don't want my cat to smell like rotten Misa soup. She's probably gonna poop in my cab. Well, deal with it, you whiny switcher. You've complained the whole trip. And this is what you get. And besides, I heard miso soups are actually good. Oh, you lousy pieces of- Shush! Now don't talk to me the rest of the trip, or else you'll find yourself back at the Bone Valley. Oh, fine! You win! As long as I don't go back to that garbage dump again. But I swear, when we get back, and my cab is full of feces, you're gonna pay for that, you hear me? Alright. What was going on? Uh, nothing. Okay, we just got your brakes tested and we're ready to proceed. Hey girls, how was your run? You won't believe what we found! What is it? Wow, so cute! Cute? More like ugly! This nice little pile of fur! This thing stunk on my cab! Now I'm gonna smell like Mesa Paste! Eddie, just shove off! I've gotten enough headaches from you! Fine! I'm gonna chill away from you clowns! And this curly little furball! Ugh, now I'm gonna demand the workmen to give me a wash! This stupid little dog licked at my cab a million times! Jerk, so rude. At least that loudmouth is out of our sight, and he should be glad that the dog gave him a wash. I heard that, Sean! You must abominable Jeevo in this excuse of a series! It's alright, Miso. The chatterbox is finally gone for good. Yeah, you don't have to worry about him anymore. Oh, so you wanna play? Miso, sit! Sit! Miso, speak! 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 Miso, roll over! Good girl! Now it's my turn. Hey, what's all that noise? And who brought this dog here? Oh, uh... Foolish engines, you know the rules. But sir, 
This poor dog seems to be lost. We found it wandering at Folkestone. Does it look like I care? We don't allow any pets here. It's a strict rule from CSX. But read his tag. All right, I'll read his tag. Hmm, yes. There looks to be a phone number on here. Okay, I'll let you guys keep it for now, but she needs to stay away from the yard, as it is a busy rail hub. I suggest y'all to move to the scrapyard if you want to play with her. Thank you. I'll call the number and see if I can get a hold of the owners. Well, Miso, we have to move to the scrapyard by the orders of the yard master. Hop in my cap. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to make Miso jump. <laughs> I love making her hyper. Now let me try. Hey girls, where did you get that dog? We saw you three arriving with her. Oh, hi Hannah and Rachel. We found it wandering along the tracks by Folkestone. Well, can we play with her? She's so adorable. Sure, but make sure she doesn't wander outside the scrapyard. Watch this. Aw, so cute. Let me try. My turn. All right, all right. Who's blowing their stupid horn? Whoever it is, shut up. I'm trying to think of the save our days. We're just playing with the dog. She gets hyper when we blow our horns. Does it look like I even care? I was peacefully taking a nap over there until you idiots decided to blow your horns over there. If it makes me so happy, then- Well then, you nasty little furball. If it makes you so happy, then eat this. <laughs> Foolish engines, who's blowing their horns loudly? Not me. Hey. Jerk! Whoever it was, you need to stop this instant. This yard isn't a backyard. I already received no influence complaints from 8075 as it is. Look what you did, Eddie. You scared me so off. Dolan, look. That precious little pooch over there. Where, Nolan? There! Are you blind? Uh, all I see is a bunch of dirty blue trains that say, uh, CXS. Wait, do I mean CVS? Ugh, look. They ran into those bushes over there. We can wait until night, and then, if she gets help to do her business, we'll swipe her. But why are we doing this again? Because those dogs are worth a fortune for the market. They're smart and worth a gold bar. Now do what I say, and let's go. It will be headed home crown rich. <laughs> so we're both going to become kings? Yay! Oh, be quiet, Dolan. Look, girls, Miso is back. Yay! Shut up! I'm trying to sleep! Okay, jeez. No need to get overly excited. But want to say that we should play with her again? Yes. My crew has extra meat so we can have more fun. All right, engines. Listen up. 400 and 949, you two will be taken to Q546 to Thomasville, Georgia. 3005 and 4783, you two will later be on the Q648 to Chicago, Illinois. 362 and 783, you both will later be on the Q601 to Houston. So, who's going to be taking care of Miso then? I got word that Miso's owners are supposed to pick her up tonight. I'll keep her by the yard office, okay? Well, that's good to know. Well then, I'm going to get refilled and later wind down for the next assignment. Same, but I'm feeling like I'm missing Miso already. Okay, on my sign. But you don't have a sign. No, not that kind of sign. But whatever, just open the trunk. So what are we doing this fresh meat? We don't have a grill. Are we gonna have a family cookout? No, miso loves meat. But there isn't any miso soup here. Not that kind of miso. What, does this look like some Japanese cuisine to you? Hey, hey there, little one. You want some fresh meat? That's right. <laughs> Come on, get back in! Get back in where? The van! Oh right, no one. Valdosta, off we go! Be quiet, Dolan! Huh? Them crooks. I ought to notify others about this. Huh? Where's Miso? Serena, what's wrong? I don't see Miso anywhere by the yard office. What? That doesn't sound good. Miso! Miso, where are you? Miso! Engines, listen up. I got very bad news here. I'm afraid I just spotted two thieves getting away in a white van with the license plate DOG8116. And they seem to have made off with Miso right now. From what I heard, their names appear to be Nolan and Dolan. In plain terms, Miso has been stolen by Nolan and Dolan. What? Oh no. But no need to worry. I've already warned Q546's crew about this. I know exactly where they're heading. I've already notified the authorities as well. Man, I hope Nisa is alright. Roger, to Q546, over. Q546, over. We got some sort of emergency problem. We're all ears, over. If you see this white van with the license plate DOG8116, be on the lookout. There are 
two thieves that have stolen a poodle, and they are driving a white van towards Valdosta. They are last spotted getting away from Rice Yard. I'll be sending crews and even the police after them. All right, then we'll be on the lookout. Q546 out. Oh man, is this Miso they're talking about? Stolen! Look out! Dang it. What now? You had a pothole and busted our tire. So? Go to the trunk and get a spare tire and a jack, you idiot. How do I do that? I've never replaced flat tires before. Just do it, you peanut head. It doesn't look like I'm food. Why can't you do it? Because I have to keep the, this little pooch in check, you ninny. But how about this? Why don't I watch the dog while you replace this? It doesn't work that way. Huh? Hurry! I'm trying. No, you're not. Hurry! There's those crooks. This ain't your dog. Yes, she is. She belongs to us. Hey, I demand you to untie us right now. Foiled again. Oh, shut up, Dolan. This is your fault anyways. <sighs> all right, you're all free. Follow me. Miso, are you all right? Oh, thank goodness you are. We don't want to lose a cute little poodle like you to those big nasty thieves. All right, we're here to take Miso back to Waycross to reunite with her owners. Bye, Miso. We're going to miss you. Well, now that we have that out of the way, let's continue our trip to Thomasville. Oh, I'm so glad she's all right. Yeah, the wrong hands could have her in danger. I would have been glad for her to get lost finally. She got slobber all over my cap. Oh, be quiet, Eddie. She could have been hurt or worse. And I don't care. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have a stupid local to take. Sayonara, and I hope I don't see you goons ever again. Jerks. Do you all see, boy man? Can you take this train for me? Get out of my way, you fatty! I've had enough of putting up with a bunch of morons in a single day! Just too many gorillas! What gorillas? I don't have any bananas, you know. Giant ape is blocking my way! Foolish engine, cut the argument right now. At 3186, you were supposed to take the Q603 an hour ago. But since you refuse, you will be helping 3307 with his DPU work on Q601. What? No! I don't want to work with that fat, annoying, sleepy head to the Volga West. This is gonna be worse than when I had to work with a bunch of unreliable 70 ms at the Bone Valley. Too bad. Your master's orders, plus you and 3307 will be dropped off at New Orleans. Now get to it right now. <laughs> Sucks to be you, loser! Once a loser, always a loser! Shut up! You're a loser too since all you can do is switch. Don't you even have a life outside your boring seaboard life? Excuse me! And my life was way better than yours, lazy! Now go out to find the other fatty of whoever his name is! Miso, I'm so glad you're all right. I'm really gonna miss her. Same. I feel like I've been attached to her. Me too. But hey, cheer up. I've heard of an NS Geep numbered 5356 whose name is Miso and behaves just like her. She somehow wandered here and she's supposed to be on our train to Chicago where she will be brought back to the NS. Really? But I thought the Yardmaster didn't say anything about it. Well, I talked to him earlier and he mentioned it. Just wait and see. Oh, hey there, little one. Are you lost? <coughs> oh, don't worry. We will bring you back to the NS in no time. Heh. <laughs> Never knew of a locomotive who acts just like a dog. Well, this dash is great. We would have had that $200,000 from her until you screw it all up! Sorry. Sorry, well, well, cut that. My god, why are you such a moron? Why do you have to be so salty all the time? What are you, 12? I'm not being salty. I'm being serious. Uh-oh. Uh -oh.